And let me just start out by saying this up front is I am guilty. Something I'm not very proud of, but 20 years ago, when I, plus when I first started practice, I did what was in my area, the first in the city, of a minimally invasive knee replacement. I got a write up in the newspaper and they came and interviewed me, took pictures. I remember it was some thing about building a ship in a bottle, but we thought it worked. And we had specially designed instruments and we were able to get the incisions down to literally barely over three inches in small females, just big enough that you can actually even fit the implants in. But it was difficult. We struggled. We had a hard time, you know, seeing everything we needed to see, but we eventually could do it. And we really thought it made a big difference. We saw people, this wasn't common back then, but they'd actually even go home the day of surgery. That was unheard of at that time. And they seemed to get better faster, but all that got disproven. It turns out it really doesn't matter. And that is the surgical approach, the surgical technique, what we call the arthrotomy. Evidence shows those don't really make a difference in recovering. 